a savory pick-me-up made with chipolina sauce and ham. Serve these pancakes for brunch or as a light supper. They're the perfect comfort food. Not just for pancake day. Make this easy pancake recipe for lunch or an easy dinner at any time of year. The Milano Secret Taste homemade pancakes filled with white yogurt, melting cheese and ham and served with chips for a wallet-friendly meal. Sounds so tempting, right? Well, make sure you watch the video till the end as a tempting story awaits. So let's get started. Ingredients for 16 pancakes. Flour, 250 grains. Yeast, 2 teaspoons. Salt, half a teaspoon. Sugar, half a teaspoon. Eggs, 2. Melted butter, 30 grains. Milk, 350 grains. Ingredients for 2 pancakes with ham, cheese and chipolina sauce. 6 pancakes. 4 slices of melting cheese. 4 slices of cooked ham. 1 jar of whole white yogurt, 125 grams, 1 teaspoon of mustard. 1 teaspoon of lemon juice. Oil. Salt. Pepper. 3 teaspoons chopped chives. Method for pancakes. Step 1. First, take a saucepan and, with very low heat, slowly melt the butter. Let it cool down a bit. Step 2. Take two bowls, in one you will put the dry ingredients, in the other the liquid ones. Step 2. Bowl dry ingredients. Put the flour, salt, sugar. These pancakes are neutral, neither sweet nor salty, so they can be eaten with both sweet and savory toppings, and the baking powder and mix. Liquid ingredients bowl. Step 1. Put the eggs, milk and melted butter and mix well. Step 2. Combine the liquid ingredients in the bowl of dry ingredients and mix well. The dough is ready. Step 3. In a hot non-stick pan, pour the mixture to make pancakes. Cook for about 30 to 40 seconds, until you see small bubbles on the surface, and then turn the pancake over and cook for about a minute more. Before we move on further, we ask you to subscribe the channel and become a part of the family, the lovely cooking family and also to hit the bell icon for notifications. This will let you know as we post a new video. So, method for pancakes with ham, cheese and chipolina sauce. For the chipolina sauce, Step 1. Add a teaspoon of mustard to the yogurt, a teaspoon of lemon juice, a pinch of salt, pepper and chives and mix everything. Step 2. Take two pancakes, on both of them put a teaspoon of onion sauce, a slice of cheese and ham and before closing the sandwich with a third pancake. Step 3. Add a slice of cheese on top of the ham. Step 4. Cook in a pan with a lid on low heat for about 3 to 4 minutes to allow the cheese to melt. They're delicious, so simple and quick to make. Easy enough to be made by kids too. The pancakes are made with ingredients that everyone has in their kitchen. Milk, flour, salt, sparkling water and flour and filled with ham and cheese. Make a perfect breakfast, brunch or light lunch slash dinner. Did you make this recipe? We'd love to hear from you. Simply write a review in the comment box below. Now let's talk about the wonderful ingredient, ham. Ham makes the cut for many holiday tables but this ubiquitous, Relatively inexpensive and easy to prepare meat also shows up in humble soups, anchors quick Tuesday night dinners and rains as a favorite sandwich ingredient. The term ham is coined from the English word ham which refers to the meat that is being cut from the hind leg of a pig. Ham is widely consumed all over the world as it is a processed meat that can be served for breakfast and even at a holiday dinner. It is prepared by curing raw pork, then smoking and seasoning it in any way you like. The origin of ham is a little ambiguous because there is no confirmed source, even though it is one of the age-old recipes. There are various theories relating to the origin of ham. According to the Chinese, they produced cured ham which was primarily the cuts of meat from the hind leg of a pig. The Romans later learned about this recipe while trading with them and soon it spread all across Western Europe. However, it is spoken of in La Russe Gastronomique that ham had an origin in Gaul. In his Latin prose De Agricultura, Cato mentioned the salting of hams around 160 BC. That's all for today guys. If you love the way we present our recipes then do like and share this video to the quick and tasty cooking lovers, and we will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.